So I'm out here still goofing off a little bit. Ian came and got me. He's right there. We just shot a really cool scene where he first time he's ever metal detected. He was in one of the AT Maxes and he just he just found like a, a cache of coins. Uh, they weren't that old, but they look pretty old, but a whole bunch of them right there. And uh, I did a beautiful little thing with my camera, but when I went to look at it, my camera was frozen, so. I got a nice little squeaker here. And um, I already dug it up and I can see some green down in the hole. I think it's going to be something kind of interesting looking. Thought it was gonna be a beer can. Oh boy, look at that. That is a little buckle. Little buckle of some sort, like um, probably too small for a shoe buckle, but yeah, that's pretty cool right there. I imagine that's going to be Georgian era, like 1700s. Looks pretty well made. Man, it sounded huge. I thought it was like a big beer can right there. Awesome. Let's check the check it with the machine just to make sure that's all it was. <laughs> here, here, let's put this over there. Yeah, I hear that. Yeah. Here's a little bit of iron over here, but yeah, that's it. That's a pretty cool little find right there. Sweet. Now we just need a big old... <laughs> now, we, now we just need to find one of these that's about three, 400 years older and made of gold. That's so why I just dug that little Georgian buckle right here. So I'm just kind of looking around a little more in the general area. And I got a good signal here, went ahead and dug it already. And I think it's a big coin. Look at the size of that thing. Where's that two coins? Ooh, it's a cache of coins, looky. There's two. That's pretty cool right there. I wonder if there's any more. You can see where they were uh, sandwiched in the dirt right there. That's a cast on each side. So it's probably just those two. <laughs> That's pretty wild. Get the uh, pinpointer out. Yeah, that was it. So someone was probably sitting right here, um, right near the bridge, just a chilling and lost two coins. I don't know what those would be dated, do you? 19 something, I guess. That's pretty sweet right there. I like that. Look at that. That's awesome, man. Big old coins. Nice. That's all right right there. Makes me happy. Guess we might as well go ahead and pull them apart while we're here. There you go. Boy, that doesn't look too good. That side's terrible. Look at that. That's horrible. I guess it reacted, you know. There's probably some type of, uh, like type of electric, uh, electric. Yeah, well, chemical reaction in the coins. And it destroyed that side. But that side's beautiful. 1905. Sweet. Before the First World War. Whoever was carrying that was still innocent of war. So right there is where I found the two coins. I got another good signal here. Sounds like coin. A coin or maybe a whole bunch of them. All right. In... Well, I don't hear it with the beeper yet, so I think they're going to be like right in here, but much deeper. I don't know if I can do this one-handed or not without destroying something, but we'll try. It's a good high squeak, though. Yeah, one more. There we go. Did I get it? Let's listen with this one. No, it's still in there. Beautiful high squeak. Huh, that's weird. Still working. A little bit more toward me, I think. Might be more than one uh, target in there. All right, let's see if that got it. If it didn't, I'm gonna have to put you away. All right. Yay! I think. That's right there. I can tell that's really close to the surface really close to the pointer because that, that got the solid beat going on i don't want to scratch it up too bad um oh yeah i got this little thing here the little doohickey 
Um, I can't really dig in this sod with this thing. Because it's, oh, I just saw it. It's a coin. Did you see it? Lucky. Huh. No idea the age of that, but it's a nice, pretty green one. I think this place is going to be loaded with coins, huh? Wow. Awesome, man. So what do you think you have? Do you want to... Something good? I'll hit it with a uh, yeah. pinpointer real quick. Oh. oh no. Still down there, man. <laughs> I thought I hit something, though. Oh, okay. By the way, okay. uh, this is Ian. He's a fellow that's taking care of me on this uh, little adventure. And he wanted to give his, uh, give his, try his hand at detecting. And found a bunch of coins over there. And nice, beautiful, big horseshoe, huh? Horseshoe. Yeah, yeah. That iron stake. And he's got something here that might be good. It's quite deep, so that's uh, promising. Not very happy. Yeah, I'd say it's like right down in, straight, straight down in the area. Keep going down. Yeah. I think. It's this thing, which is a piece of coke. A what? Piece of coke. That has, like that has iron coal. in it? It gives a signal on a metal oh. detector. Yeah. Yeah, it was a little bit, remember, it was kind of a little bit of a funky signal, but it wasn't yeah. squeak. I think that's all it was, man. Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> Tell you what, let me uh, move that out of the way. This little piece right there. And just run the machine over it again. Sure. Just to make sure. Because that was really deep. Um, What number are you getting on that? 11, 